if you'd asked me a year ago if I was really scared and nervous about doing this kind of thing and handing everything over to God, um, then the answer would have been yes. I would have been truly terrified. It wasn't that I was kind of crossing a line from one thing to another. It felt more like I was jumping off a cliff because I thought that there was a, a call on my life for engineering. I was sure that that was the path that God had got me on. And then I got to second year and my whole world kind of just got flipped a bit upside down because I started to hear God telling me that actually engineering isn't what I've got for you. It was really scary and there was a lot of fear when I had to hand all of that over to God and I had to say, okay, well, I've already given you the fact that I'm leaving what could potentially be a fairly secure, fairly well-paid job to do what I believe you've called me to do. You don't really find a destination until you're in heaven. And so the rest of what you're doing along the way is all part of a journey. I'm coming to Bible college because I know that God has placed a calling on my life, but I can't put my finger on and say, God has specifically called me to this. So I guess part of my hope for this, these three years is that that calling is really gonna be explored. That was the jump that I took when I moved over to Northern Ireland. At the moment, I'm kind of free falling and waiting to see what God's got in store for me. And it's just a matter of trusting him um, because there's no turning back.